to the crease. The best green around is what goes in on top. Dab smears and Keith in the rest of feet don't stop. Track rooms in the weed. Thanks for rolling up. I'm Two Bill Marley. This is Certified Pie Hit. Smoking on one of my nighttime splits. You know, we about to do burk up. About to take a look at these cannabis conspiracy theories, which I like to call cannabis conspiracy theories. Today's theory revolves around the dairy industry. Are cows secretly grazing the grass that's greener? Grab your pitchforks, don your tie dye overalls, and prepare for the conspiracy theory you never knew you needed. Cows produce better milk when they're chilling next to cannabis plants. That's right, forget free range, organic, or grass fed. The future of dairy is all about high quality milk, pun very much intended. But don't just take my word for it. Let me introduce you to Farmer Herb, a hippie dippy dairy man who swears by the power of a mellow meadow. Herb isn't just a farmer, he's a cow whisperer, a bovine bard, a prophet of pastures. And he's here to tell you why his cows are the dankest dairy producers in the biz. Imagine Farmer Herb strolling through his pasture, strumming a banjo and humming a Bob Marley tune. Don't worry, be dairy. He coos to Daisy, his favorite cow. Daisy gazes back with the calm wisdom of a creature who's seen it all. The smell the terpenes wafting from Herb's cannabis plants. You see, Herb explains, happy cows make better milk and nothing makes a cow happier than the sweet aroma of moo joanna. It's like aromatherapy, but for others. Research, okay, imaginary research, suggests that cannabis plants emit terpenes that reduce stress. For Daisy and her friends, this means no more freaking out over clanging machinery or existential questions like, am I just a milk machine for humans? Herb likes to call it mooditation. Here's a riddle for you. Moo in a tail, I roam the land. The dairy farm's pride. I'm in high demand. I'll give you something you drink every day. What am I munching on, hey? Farmer Herb isn't just about vibes. He's about results. Ever notice how my milk is creamier, dreamier, and downright dank? He asks, handing you a frothy glass. It's the can of butter effect. He swears that cows grazing near cannabis plants absorb trace amounts of cannabinoids creating milk that's smoother than a jazz saxophone solo. A milk doesn't just strengthen your bones, it chills you to the bone, he says with a wink. Herb dreams of a day when a dairy owl evolved. Whole milk for the traditionalist, 2% milk for the semi-bowl, sativa milk for your morning espressos, indica milk for your bedtime cocoa, hybrid half and half for the indecisive. I settle for basic milk. Herb acts when well, you can have mulata nirvana. Here's another riddle. I'm in the building where hay is stored, holding the treasures the cows adore. Tall and round, I stand on the farm. What am I full of rustic charm? Herb strokes his beard conspiratorially. Think Big Dairy doesn't know about this? He whispers. They've been experimenting with Operation Mulahoma for years. According to Herb, dairy giants are secretly planting cannabis near their pastures. The organic label is just a smoke screen, pun intended. The real secret is Mujuana milk. Why do organic brands taste better? Herb chuckles knowingly. It's not just happy cows, it's high cows. But Big Dairy won't admit it. They're afraid everyone will start growing their own cannabis fed cows. It's not about the milk, Herb warns. It's about the moony riddle time. I'm a straw line bed where cows like to lay, soft and dry at the end of the day. I'm not a chair or a couch, that's true. What am I, cozy and new? Critics argue that cannabis fed cows could produce milk with traces of THC. Herb shrugs. So what if your cereal gets a little elevated, he jokes. It's not like anyone's going to complain about Lucky Charms tasting extra magical. He envisions marketing campaigns. Glass and relax. The only milk that pairs with Netflix and chill. Warning. May cause you to move in slow motion. Herb pulls a carton from his cooler. Try my pasture puff pastry creamer. It's utterly. Here's another riddle for you. A hum and spin in the milking shed. Turning hard work to butter and bread. I separate and churn. A farmer's delight. What machine am I working day and night? As the sun sets over Herb's pasture, he waves to Daisy and her friends. They'll never admit it, but 
Cannabis is the future dairy, he says, lighting a joint and toasting to the cows. Maybe he's right. Maybe he just inhaled a few too many terpenes. Either way, one thing's for sure, the next time you pour a glass of milk, take a sip, and think about former herb. Stay chill, he says, grinning. Always keep it mood is the answer to the riddle. Cow, a silo, a cow stall, a butter churn. I'll see you all in the next one, bruh.